All right, troops, Yoker Uni presents. Okie dokie, use law, it's physics time again. Two big things to discuss. We're going to cover something today which is pure tricky to understand because it doesn't quite sit right in your heads. But first things first though, I need to have you clear up a big misconception that most of the world get mixed up here and it's all today with the difference between your mass and your weight. When people ask each other what their weight is, and they purely get an answer in stones or kilograms, they don't realise how wrong they are, and also how mad it makes me. The unit of stones and kilograms are both units of mass, no weight. Mass is the amount of stuff that makes you up, how many atoms you've got. This stays the same no matter where you go in the solar system or the universe. Weight is a force down to the centre of the earth in newtons, and it's heavy work to it by multiplying your mass times gravity. W equals mg. Your weight can change if you go to different planets even though your mass stays the same. So here's a good way to pure remember what the difference is. If you want to lose weight, go to the moon. If you want to lose mass, go to the bog. I should mention though that going to the bog is a euphemism, aye that's a word, it's a euphemism for going to the toilet. If you want to use your own euphemism, feel free, you could use something like, see a man about a dog, ascend the throne, test the plumbing, lay some cable, go number twosie, rassle a chanty, and of course my personal favourite, Send a message to the Ninja Turtles. Now on to the pure dodgy stuff. You're going to find this a bit mental at first, but go through a few times just to get it. If you glake like it, a few times more. Here we go. First, a question you think about. Do you feel the force that is your weight? The answer is, of course, no you don't. When you stand on the ground, you've got your weight acting pure down the way cosy gravity. But you're standing dead still. So there must be an equal and opposite force back on your feet by the ground. It's this force that you feel, and this is called your apparent weight. Most of the time this will be the same or there boots as your own weight. But there are some situations where your apparent weight might be bigger or smaller. If you don't believe me, then get on your table and jump off. When you land on the ground, your weight is balanced by the force of the ground on your feet. But there's also a wee additional force on your feet, which is going to decelerate you until you stop. This additional force added to the force to balance your weight means that you feel a bigger force than usual on your feet for a wee fraction of a second. This means that your apparent weight will be bigger for a wee bit, and you will feel heavier. Try it your button if you're still no getting me. For physics in school, some of you need to apply this apparent weight crap to situations in a lift. If you have never been in a lift before, then what have you been doing all your life? Fire down to the seat in the centre and pure got down in the lifts is mental. People are going to give you pure weird looks, but take no notice of them. These people are fake bears den. And they look at everyone that way, don't worry about it wee man. So you are in a wee lift and you're going up and down. You will notice that when a lift starts to move up or down, you will sometimes feel a bit heavier or sometimes a wee bit lighter. Something must be happening to your apparent weight, so let's figure it out. Let's suppose you take a set of scales into a lift. The scales don't move and they appear in contact with the lift floor. It doesn't move so all the forces are pure balance with it. Now take a step onto the scales and your weight is going to heavy act down onto them. Cause you don't move anywhere, the scales get equal and opposite force back up on your feet. The force that it gives you is what it actually measures and displays on the scales. Let's recap for the thickles then. The set of scales doesn't display your weight, it displays the force it has to give you so that you stay dead still. In other words, it's your apparent weight. 